Well, I just found out that YouTube is going to be deleting uh, fake channels and inactive channels on the 16th of this month of June. And as far as the fake channels go, I don't care. Delete them all you want. But the channels that are inactive, there's, you know, I was close to those people when I first started and uh, I'm still subscribed to them. And they do have videos still up. Yes, they haven't been in their accounts for a long time. Sometimes, uh, some five years, others four years. <coughs> but I just have one a few days ago who hasn't vlogged in four years make a comment on my video. And the moment I saw her name, even though it was a different account, because she's now just starting it all over again, I knew it was her right away. And so I thought it was awesome. I w always wondered where she go. You know, why did she leave? And I and I thought I said to her, uh, "Did you forget your password?" Because I've seen other people do the same thing. And she said, "Yes, she actually did." But she still didn't say why didn't she just make up a new account then and keep blogging from that moment on. You know, um, and that's okay. You know, she didn't want to tell me. She don't have to tell me. But it's awesome that she's back and now she's blogging with her husband. And in fact, I'm gonna put a link down below. Uh, so you can check out her channel. She only has uh, a couple videos, I think like five. And um, now I get to see her husband, you know, her house. She's got these pug dogs. And it's just awesome to see somebody finally come back from the old days, you know. Um, the rest of them haven't done that. Well, there is actually one other person that did. She didn't talk to me, but she did make a few videos. And then she left again. And she hasn't made a video in like almost 10 months. So, is that channel going to be deleted too? I don't know. I don't. It didn't say how far back a person has to be inactive in order for them to be gone. But I think it's, you know, some people want to take breaks. You know what I mean? Right now, the wine cone's taking a break. Are they going to delete his channel because he hasn't been in there for five months and made a video? I hope not. Um... Some people think it's a great idea. Everybody's probably going to lose subscribers. And I just made a video where I finally reached a thousand subscribers. And I know it's going to go down because a lot of those people are not vlogging anymore or haven't made, um, haven't been in their account. And so they're going to be gone. So who knows how many uh, subscribers I'm going to have left. I have no idea. But um, probably going to be below a thousand. Um, and it just kind of sucks. I'm a keeper of memory, so I like having those channels there. I check them out from time to time, you know, and I watch the videos, and and it brings back the memories of talking to them and adding them to Yahoo and stuff like that, or MySpace, and we had a great time. You know, the friendship didn't last because of whatever reason. Don't know. But, I mean, it had nothing to do with me. I think they got tired of the Internet, or a lot of them uh, got boyfriends, and the boyfriends got jealous and said, you have to weed out. You can keep the women, and you can keep family, but the other guys have to go. I've already heard this a couple times. And so you just never know why. They might have died. A, a couple people have actually died that were subscribed to me, and I was subscribed to them. But it just, so, oh, man, yes. One of them is a guy who actually sang a lot of songs and stuff. He had a heart attack and died. So his channel, his work that he did... It's going to be gone. Oh my God. That really sucks because in a way I thought my channel and my videos, let's say I died, I thought it would live on and people would be able to see it. You know, I'm going to have to make sure that somebody knows my password and they can keep logging in every once in a while. So, you know, my channel don't get removed. That sucks. Oh man. And on top of that, they got rid of scheduling. You cannot schedule a video anymore. I went to schedule because a lot of the sh uh, show and tales and uh, story time are scheduled from three months ago. And I went in there, I made new ones, and I was going to upload them and schedule them, and the scheduling is gone. The ones that are still scheduled, which is only two, that's all I got left, they are still scheduled. So it won't remove the ones that are scheduled, um, but it will remove, I mean, it we'll, won't, won't give you the option to do scheduling anymore. I don't know what the hell happened, but they're always changing something, ain't they? All right. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this. Is it a good idea? Is it a bad idea? You know, there's going to be a lot of people who are going to lose subscribers because people, whatever reason, forget their password. You know, whatever. They die or whatever. 
should you really lose that subscriber number? I think it means something to me, you know? I, it took me six years to get to a thousand. It means something to me, you know? But so does everything else. All right, you guys have a good one. Take care and God bless.